What is going on my frosty little friends? My name is Frosty Alpha and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Y Egglock. Now in the last episode we hatched another egg, we got another member of the team, and we made our way through the route and made it all the way here to Lumio City, and we met up with the Pokemon Professor's assistants who now want us to go talk to the Pokemon Professor himself, so let us go and get on to that right now. So, uh, so it was a pretty, uh, pretty just about general, uh, Pokemon episode last episode, but, uh, they should pick up usually soon. Mm, I'm trying to remember the voice I gave this chick. It's been a couple of days. So, um, so this is the building where Professor Sycamore's lab, uh, let's go inside. Um, okay. Like, you're, you're just not even gonna leave me? Like, really? You've traveled a long way from Vanneville Town, but you're finally here. The Pokemon- sorry. The Professor can't wait to meet you. You can find him on the third floor. So hop in the elevator. Okay. If I don't want to, if I want to go talk to this lady. Research lab, research Pokemon, evolution. Okay. So it's apparent that we're gonna go. Uh... Let's go to the second floor. Let's explore the Pokemon Professor's lab before we do this. So. Is that being a tool for research? Nope. Oh, nice. There's where the Rotoms are. Hopefully we'll get a... Hopefully we'll get a Rotom in this... This LP. Okay, so let's go... Uh, let's go talk to the Professor and see what he wants to do for us. There we go. There he is. So, we finally meet. Fantastic, you're here. Come this way, won't you? I love that they say come this way, they don't even like have me come this way. I'll come this way in a minute, I want to talk to your assistant here. Ha, false wipe. Mm hmm, mm-hmm, that's why I wanted to talk to everybody. It's pretty much useless unless I'm going for a Pokemon faint, uh, Pokemon itself. Ah, many thanks for coming all the way from Vanneville Town. I'm Professor Sycamore. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. How has, how has your Pokemon journey been so far? Have you met many different Pokemon? Fantastic. Let me let me take a quick look at your Pokedex and see. Hmm. So you've seen 28 kinds of Pokemon in Central Kalos, then? Oh, ho, ho, these pages are getting filled. It's starting to look good. Well. Now, you do have a certain Zen and Qua. Uh, forgive me if I butchered that. I, I do not know French. Uh, I have a good feeling about you. At first, I was thinking of choosing only one child from the town when I was deciding who to give a Pokemon to. In Vanneville Town, it is going to be a child of a veteran trainer I know. About then, I learned of a Rhyhorn racer, Grace and her daughter were moving here. Here, from the here in the Kalos region, you are far away from everything you used to know. That really hit me right here. Just, just hit me right in the feels. Just, just right in my feels, right there. And then it, then it hit me. I should give a Pokemon. I should give you a Pokemon, and have you travel around Kalos. Hi, Professor. It's Shauna. Oh God. Uh, sorry to keep you waiting. Fantastic. Now, let's have a Pokemon battle. Your opponent shall be me. Uh, uh, wait, what? What? Uh, uh, what if I don't want to? I'm gonna battle in a lab. Alright, fine. Shall we start the battle then? Yes. Okay, apparently we're gonna battle. We're gonna battle the professor. Alright, you're gonna get it. Oh, dude, Amber's gonna work! Dude, Arcane is going to freaking work! So, eat this Flare Blitz! Eat it! Yeah, one shot of Bulbasaur. It's a good thing, too, because 
I wasn't actually sure of the levels of this battle when he said let's battle, so I'm really kind of glad that uh, he's uh, not too overly leveled. Alright, good job. Get, why is my, my headset cord is like just all over the place now? Alright, uh, what's the other mud bomb? Uh, you know, let me check, let me check the thing on that. It's a special move. And it hits pretty hard. So let's do that instead of, you know what, let's just get rid of Fisher. Because Fisher's way too, way too iffy. And it, it has like a really terrible chance of actually hitting, so. Let's just forget Fisher. Fisher is pretty much useless. I mean, it's got a, like a 1 in 3 chance of actually hitting something. Alright, Bacon. Bacon, good job, Bacon. Uh, defensive curl. No, no, no. Keep, keep, no. Keep your old moves. Alright, so. It's about to send out Squirtle. Yeah, we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna let, um. It's fine. I'm actually gonna let Nico, Nico do this one. So. So. It's, it's got a Squirtle. I should be able to pretty much damn near two shot this thing. So, so let's see. Oh, I should have gone for double slap. Let's screw it. Still two shot it. Please, please, Squirtle, please. You, you get slapped around by Nico Robin. Uh, this thing is, man, this thing's Nico's gonna be such a boss in this LP. Good job, Arcane. Gotta send on a Charmander, huh? So, no, no, switch Pokemon. Let's go to Gary. Gary can pretty much one shot this thing with Water Pulse. I don't know why I'm so thirsty. I'm just all over the place, and I'm so thirsty right now. Uh, it's just what really It's weak to both. Scratch, too, please. You ain't gonna touch Gary. Gary's gonna get you. Get him, Gary. Look at that. It was, oh, dude, that was a crit, too. Yeah, accuracy. Water pulse. I'm not gonna chance the accuracy on this one. Oh, you would, you smoke screen, wouldn't you? You gonna really hit my accuracy? This freaking thing. Please stop. Please stop. Thank you, Gary. So, so if you guys were watching E3, E3 is going on this weekend. Uh, I just uh, this whole week actually. So, uh, there was a couple of good, a uh, couple of good presentations. The uh, the new Hideo Kojima game looks pretty cool looking. Uh, plus, uh, what's the one that looks like Bioshock? It reminds me of Bioshock. What is it? Uh, Happy. Happy something, something. I, did, I I could not remember the name of it, but it was at the Xbox conference. It looked pretty cool. And then uh, so, so haha! <laughs> you're too much for me. You're really something, aren't you? All right. So yeah, thanks thanks for all that Poke money. I really appreciate that. So uh, so there's actually quite a big game, quite a few games. The new Zelda looks really good. I, I'm actually really excited for the new Zelda game. So I think I figured it out. Figured out what? Sira, you must have an int you are indeed <laughs> sorry. You are an interesting Pokemon trainer indeed. It must be fantastic. It, it'd be fantastic if you took another Pokemon with you. Here, pick one. Dude, do we get a gem one starter? <gasps> we get a gem one starter! Oh, but I don't get the no 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 no. Right here. Sorry guys. Oh no no no, what do I what do I want to pick? I love Charmander though. I really love Charmander. But I like I like them all. Oh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? Uh, I think I'm gonna pick. Char I'm just gonna pick Charmander, because I love Charmander. Charmander is one of my favorite Pokemon of all time. So, ah, you picked Charmander then. I see. Simply wonderful. Yay! We got a Charmander. Char Char Charmander. Uh, so you give a Pokemon a nickname? No, that's because. Uh, oh, I see. So you don't want to give your Pokemon a nickname then. Since you chose Charmander, I'll give you this. Oh, do we get a Mega Sound? Oh, if I'd known that, I would have gotten the other one of the other ones. All right, whatever. I better hope I get a Charmander now. Uh, come now, you two, pick a Pokemon. I don't know which one to pick. It's so difficult. It's okay. Take your time. 
But don't take too long. I have I don't have all day. Well, I've seen you. I've got a feeling everyone else will be showing up soon. Hi, Professor Sycamore. What's this? Everyone's already here. See? Wonderful. Everyone's all here. Now that we're all here, I'd like to say a few words. Be the best trainer you can be. And at the same time, remember that you have to have fun traveling with your Pokemon. Also, I want you to <laughs> I want to ask for help. Ask for your help in solving the Kalos region's biggest Pokemon mystery. The secret and potential of Mega Evolution. A new kind of evolution that occurs in battle. That's why I gave you that Mega Stone just now. It's an important clue. Mega Stone? Mega Evolution. What should we do about the Pokedex? Trevor, my lad, if that's what, what best trainer means to you, then I want you to go out there and complete the Pokedex. Mega Evolution sounds really interesting. If you're, interested, if you're investigating Mega Evolution, why don't you check out Campfire Town? Uh, excuse me. The town has a lot of history. You might find a hint there. Now listen. If you visit many different places and complete the Pokedex, you'll probably see Pokemon in many new ways of living and meet people in many new ways of thinking. First, accept the ways of living and thinking that sometimes conflict with your own. And thinking, and think about what's really important. This will truly broaden your horizons. Um, I think being different from others is part of what makes me special. Mastering evolution will definitely set me apart from other trainers. Yeah, yeah. You know what? I was thinking that too. So, okay, so we got a new member of the squad right now. Uh, I'm gonna just go to the super training button. So, I'm gonna get out of here. So, we, we did pick up a... Uh, yeah, down to the first floor. I guess apparently we can't go to the super training button. Can we not super train? Or do anything at all? Nothing like that? Uh, so. Ooh. Oh, okay. I don't know who this guy is. Um. Alright, so. I'm able to meet with them soon, then. Yes. These children chosen by the professor. I wonder what potential they'll have. I don't know why I just went Australian with that voice right there. I have no idea why. But you know what? It fits. It fits. And here's one of them now. That's Sarah. Sarah, come here a second. Oh. Oh, sorry. I forgot the voice I did. Oh. You received a Pokedex from the professor then. How wonderful. That is a wonderful thing indeed. You are one of those chosen ones. I'm the Sandra. I've tried to learn as much about Pokemon as I can to help build a brighter future. Professor Sycamore has taught me so much. Ah, and I see you have a hollow caster. Knowledge is power, after all. Put it to good use. Now listen, this is a vital. <clears throat> it is vital that this world becomes a better place, and the people in Pokemon chosen to make the world. Better must work tirelessly to achieve this goal. Well, I'm off. Please give Professor Sycamore my best. My desire is for a more beautiful world. I don't know if that voice fits, but you know what? That's what his voice is going to be from now on. Still, I wonder what kind of beautiful world Lysandre Dream desires. In this great big Kalos region, there are many different Pokemon. I hope getting a Pokedex gives you a chance to learn about them. Yes. Yes, I hope it does too. Okay, so we need to get to a... We need to get to a... God, every cutscene in the world right now. Alpha Queen! There's a place I want to go check out. I'll see you around. Uh, there's something I want to talk to you about. I'll be waiting at the Cafe Soleil. Soleil? Soleil, neighbor. The Cafe Soul. I wonder what Callum wants to talk about. Why wouldn't he just use the Holocaster? And no, no clue. But I, but it seems hush hush. I don't know why his voice is now changing every time I do it now. I am curious about what's going on. 
But we should probably stay out of it. Oh, hey, Alpha Queen. Get to Canver Town. Leave the lab, turn left, and go straight. That can have a soul Caleb was talking about was over that way, too. Okay. Hey, it ain't going to tell me twice. I'm just trying to... Oh my goodness, so many cutscenes! Let me also say it's very large. I'm sorry, it's very large. But if you stay on the main streets, you shouldn't get lost. Uh, I'm gonna go for a little walk. These streets sure wind and wander here. Alright, I'll see you later! Oh, and just so you know, Camphire Town and Cafe Soul are over this way. Okay, so I need a Pokemon Center. I, I definitely didn't want a Pokemon Center. Oh, there it is. Pokemon Center, Pokemon Center. Okay, so we did get a new Pokemon, which means now we have a new Pokemon we can do it out for. We can trade it out for. So uh, I'm actually gonna bring up, sorry, because I don't have my phone on me right now. Uh, so let me just bring this up. Okay, so I'm gonna generate a number and we're gonna generate the number 42. Okay, so uh, that's 30, six, and 42. Okay, so this egg right here is going to be ours for our Charmander here. And that is uh, level 10. Okay, so it's level 10. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So it's level 10. And I'm interested to see what kind of Pokemon we're going to get out of this. Alright, it hatches up. A Venonat! Okay, okay. I'm, I'm not sure if I want to make it part of the team just now, right now. Uh, but I'm gonna name this thing Mothra. So we got Mothra. I really hope I spelled it right. Uh, so we got Mothra the Venonat. I actually want to check this thing because I, uh, God, I have not seen Venonat since Gen One. You know what? Let's actually heal up. All right, welcome to the Pokemon Center, and I, I like the little cutscenes that they have, it, like zooms in like this. But uh. Getting back before we got all of the cutscenes, I've uh, been watching a lot of stuff for E3 this weekend. There's a lot of good games. The, the new Zelda ones got me really hyped. Uh, of, of course, the new layouts for the for uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon, the whole bottom screen. I love that. I love the addition of that to the game. I really wish we could have seen the Rotom decks. Unfortunately, we didn't. They didn't show it to me. Spoiler alerts. But uh, what, what game from E3, if you watched it, are you really hyped about? Like, which game that came out or that you saw would made you really, really happy? I think seeing the Pokemon footage really made me, like, want to go out and play Pokemon. But uh, I think Zelda really had me excited because it was, like, a really vast open world Zelda. And so that one that one seemed really cool. Oh, wait. Why am I in the, why am I in the bank? Why am I in the bank? I need to level this thing up. So, I need, I need to level this thing up real quick, and I am in the wrong positioning here. So, let's go. There we go. Put our pen down. So, we're going to have this Venomad. I'm not sure if I really want to put it on the team or not. Uh, I think I might move either Arcane or Tempig to the... Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I think I'm going to hold off on Venomoth and I'm gonna actually, uh, or Mothra here, and I'm actually gonna bring it down. I'm gonna leave it in the bank for a little while because I don't wanna have a full, full team. And I already have two fire types. I have a good immunity, but I don't wanna have a full team just yet. Um, I mean, I'm not sure, because we're going into a rock type gym and this thing probably just gets absolutely obliterated by rock, especially if it's flying bug. And I've already got two weaknesses already, so let's see. Let's do some checking out on this thing and see what its what its stats are. Uh, so it, it's buck poison. Okay. And then there's ten delays. Places some powers up, not very effective moves. So we have disable foresight tackle and supersonic. Oh my god, this thing is so bad. Um, it, luckily, it looks like it's a modest nature. Oh no no yeah it is it is it is. So it's a, it's a very good special attacker, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it on the on-deck box, and we're going to hold off on this thing. I'll bring it in should we need to actually bring it in later on. Maybe the fairy gym or something like that. I'll train it up, and we'll uh, we'll bring it to the fairy gym. So we'll see here. Let's bring this. Uh, Mothra, you're going to be on deck right here. So uh, might use you later. I really want to get a grass type. I really, really, really want a grass type. So Okay, so let's get out of here. We feel our Pokemon up. And... Uh, so we're going to go meet up with Shauna right now. And we're going to go meet her up at the cafe here. Alpha Queen, check this out. 
you can you can make trainer PR videos right here. This is called a PR studio. Making her own PR video. It's like a dream come true. They can make a quick video for you, or you can edit your own masterpiece. I'll put my heart into this into those ten seconds and put it, <laughs> and put them out there for the world to see. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, you know what? We're not supposed to meet up. We're supposed to meet. We're supposed to go to the cafe. Where's the cafe? Um. Where's this cafe? Oh, there's Callum. Okay. So we're gonna go meet up with Callum right now. It was actually Callum. I forgot. We're not supposed to meet Sean. We're supposed to meet Callum. All right. Come with me for a second. All right. Well, I mean, do I do I really get a choice here? Let's go. So okay, we're doing pretty good for time. Uh, we might go get another one. Oh. Okay, do we have a, we, okay, we have somebody new. And this is uh, a girl. Oh, this is uh, this is Diantha. Diantha. Oh, it's Lysandra. And isn't that Diantha? So, get this, neighbor. So, get this. Little, okay, so get this, girl. Um, Lysandra is the head of Lysandra Labs, which created the Holocaster, a video messaging device. You already know about Diantha, right? She's like one of the most famous movie stars in the world, after all. I wonder what the two of them are doing here together. You play young girl so wonderfully in the debut on a silver screen. Wouldn't you rather remain young and beautiful forever and always play such roles? Oh man, I really gotta come up with a voice for her. Well, I'm sorry. <clears throat> I think it was it should be like flow. It should be like an airy flowy voice. Um, what a strange question. Why would I want to play a role the same... Sorry, why would I want to play the same old roles forever? Youth may be beautiful, but it's not all there is to life. Everything changes. I want to live and change like that too. So I look forward to playing different roles as I get older. <laughs> you were chosen to be a movie star, correct? Isn't it your duty to be ever beautiful? Everything beautiful should stay that way forever. I know. I sorry, I would end the world in an instant so that beauty never fades. I can't stand I can't stand oh sorry, I can't stand the thought of the world becoming uglier. Oh, hello, sir. This is Diantha, one of the most accomplished movie stars in Carlos. She moves the mag multitudes with her excellent acting. Which is to say, she dedicates her life to making other people happy. Oh, if only everyone were like her. What a beautiful world this would be. If you'll excuse me. Dude, he's, he's kind of creepy. Like, with that voice, I make him kind of creepy. And who are you two? Oh, I I'm Callum. It's a pleasure. And uh, this is... Sarah, right? I heard Lysandre call you that. You both have lovely names. Oh, and you're both trainers. Don't your Pokemon look happy? I'm a trainer myself in my off time. I look forward to us battling someday. Okay. Hmm. I guess Pokemon trainer. Trainer, uh, I guess Pokemon trainers all battle each other, no matter well, no matter who they are. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. How about you and I complete and s compete and see who ends up stronger? I know we set off on this journey right just right after you arrived to Vanneville, but we are neighbors. An egg of egg competition sounds like a lot of fun. I won't lose though, just to let you know that. All right, well, fine. You wanna. You wanna challenge me? Dude, come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Okay, so uh, let us see where we're supposed to be. I think uh, we're supposed to go to Camp Fear Town. So it looks like I think we're supposed to go this way. Okay, so we got a hollow clip. Uh, I, we must be going the right way since we got a hollow clip there. So check this out. Um, I'm here on Route Five. Oh, wait, 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 what? 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 Oh, cool. So I'm actually holding the DS here. Uh, so I'm out here on Route 5 now, right now, and it's just hopping with wild Pokemon. I mean, hurry up and check it out, girl. You know, it's, I, I'm probably going to change this voice like 15 times throughout this freaking Let's Play. Okay, so let's... Oh, you know what? Uh, while we're here... Uh, yeah, I keep getting sidetracked. 
Oh, haircut. Is this? Oh, this must be part of the character customization. Okay, I want to definitely. Let's say hairstyle and color for you. Uh, style and color. Yes. All over. Uh, you know what? Yeah, styling and color. Yeah, all over. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna blow it. I'm gonna blow it. So. Um, you know what? I think we're gonna go with me. Maybe medium? Should we go medium or bob? I think we're gonna go with medium. Let's go with medium. Surprise me. You know, it just surprised me. Ugh. Um, you know what? Uh, let's go with Sideswept. So let's see how this looks. Um, I'm not gonna do this again, so. Oh wow, we actually look really good. We look really, I oh, don't know, we like that. I like this, I like this. I like this style. Here we go. Very well. Okay, so th three grand, we're gone. So, okay. Uh, <laughs> I wish I could buy some, buy some new outfits here. Uh, so there should be like a, is there an outfit buyer, somebody I can tr I'm gonna buy some outfits from? Okay. Apparently not, so I'm not gonna worry about the outfits right now until we get to a little bit later. But uh, I do want to go pick up some more potions from the Pokemon Center. So I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center real quick. Uh, we will go, we will go out, we will get our first encounter, and then we will probably come back and end the episode right there because we're already pushing for a good time. Uh, actually, you know what? I think we're just gonna end the episode right here. You know, yeah, we'll do that. So we changed up our hairstyle. Let's. Uh, how many Pokeballs do I have? I have enough of those. Uh, let's get some. Um, Let's go with five of those. And uh, let's just get, uh, you know, let's go with one more super potion. And we'll go with one of those. Okay, okay, so we're out of money right now. We're broke. So we're broke right now. Uh, like I said, let's heal up our Pokemon one last time. All right. All right. And I believe we're actually gonna end the, yeah, you know what, we're gonna end the episode right here today. So, um, so, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, always like, like the video, comment, and subscribe if you truly liked it. Uh, if you ended up giving me an egg and you see your egg, uh, on the on the let's play just comment down below tell me which which egg you gave me so uh, I always appreciate feedback and any any sort of feedback you guys can give me so uh, in the next episode we're gonna go and we're gonna try to make our way to Camp Fear Town and uh, we're gonna get our encounter we're gonna get, uh, hatch another egg and we're gonna see if it becomes part of the team or if it sits on the on deck box so uh, have yourselves a good day and remember stay frosty my friends all right